on your screens we are looking at the stock price of Mulin automotive and today the stock is down 2.5 percent trading at one dollar 13 cents the volume today for Mulin automotive is a bit uh, low it's at 20 million shares that have exchanged hands and this is uh, compared to an average volume of 108 million shares that would typically exchange hands on a given day we still have about three hours to the close of market and if you look at the top of your screens you will see that most of the indices at uh, indexes on wall street are down today you have the s p 500 which is down 3.14 percent the dow 30 down 2.26 percent nasdaq down 3.85 percent and the russell 2000 down 4.39 percent so it's a very rough day on uh, wall street and uh, if you look at the graph of Mullen Automotive, you can see that it opened at $1.13 and then it was able to climb all the way up to $1.16 and uh, the trend right now is upward. So with three hours to go, we don't know how the day is going to end for Mullen Automotive. Uh, back to the company, we still are waiting for the Fortune 500 customer that will be revealed by the end of this second quarter you have uh, the uh, the new the battery the cells that they are working on the uh, ground breaking you know solid state polymer uh, batteries that they still have to build into a pack and have it tested and that will be going on the Mulen 5 and uh, i just saw a post about a lady i think her name is stephanie who paid a visit she's very bullish on Mullen and she paid a visit to the Mullen factory and uh, she was giving a tour and she got to sit and uh, you know take a picture with the Mullen 5 prototype so she came out of that visit with very uh, good vibes and she also had a t-shirt that was given her so that's the news we have about Mullen automotive uh, again, I always like to stress this point. Uh, Mullen Automotive is not like a traditional stock. It tends to do its own thing irrespective of what's happening in the market. So if you are buying this stock or you are playing with this stock, uh, just be prepared you know, to, for a wild ride. It's just definitely like Tesla used to be back in the day where irrespective of good PR or bad PR, Tesla stock just seemed to have a mind of its own. It's the same story here with Mullen Automotive. However, they are, uh, there's a small and a very passionate group of people who are definitely into Mullen Automotive. And so uh, it's a very good stock in my opinion. Anyways, uh, thank you for your time. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. We have three hours to the close of market. So I will jump off here and allow you guys to place your trades, uh, your final trades for the day. Thanks for your time and bye.